Federal investigators are back on the scene of a deadly plane crash this morning just outside Porterville, looking for clues into what caused that small plane to go down, killing two members of the Tulare County Sheriff's Department. 23 ABC's Jessica Harrington joining us live this morning near Lake Success with the very latest. Jessica. We know that this morning around 7 a.m., a recovery specialist showed up to the scene to collect the final debris from the area. Now that has been loaded up on a flatbed trailer to be hauled away. Two white tarps loaded with debris and a charred pile of what looks like part of the engine is all that's left from Sheriff 1, the Tulare County Sheriff's plane. The FAA and NTSB were on scene all day yesterday trying to piece together what caused the plane to crash into the side of the hill with no distress call. Before crashing, the flight crew was assisting deputies on the ground with an arrest. The plane was headed back to their regular patrol duties and crashed shortly after, killing pilot James Chavez, who was a former Black Hawk pilot, and Sheriff's Deputy Scott Ballantyne, who had been with the Sheriff's Department for 27 years. So far, NTSB and the FAA have not given a preliminary report as to the cause of the accident, and officials say right now it's not clear how long it will be before we receive that information. And any time now, the recovery specialist will be leaving this area to haul away the debris to Phoenix, where it will be in a recovery storage facility, and the Sheriff's Department is cleaning up behind me. They will also be leaving this area soon. For now, we will be continue to keep you updated on the latest investigation on our new mobile and tablet app. You can find it in the App Store under 23ABC News. Reporting live near Porterville, Jessica Harrington, 23ABC.